I have an elderly patient who had been a patient for some time before I adopted Lenap into my practice. And we did uh, comprehensive dentistry on him, crowns, bridges, uh, partial dentures, really did a lot of treatment for him. But I had one problem that I was a bit concerned about and he had a nine millimeter probe in. So a deep pocket between his tooth and gum that was caused by just very localized bone loss. It was also a bridge abutment, so he had a bridge that attached that tooth. So I was very concerned about the long-term prognosis of this particular tooth. I didn't want to remove it, but at the same time, I thought it might have a root fracture. With a nine millimeter pocket uh, that doesn't resolve, and certainly if it progresses and gets worse uh, frequently, uh, we'll need to remove that tooth at some point. Uh, it's very possible if we can't maintain that pocket. So. If we have to remove the tooth and that tooth has a bridge attached to it, then it's not just losing one tooth, it's actually losing two teeth. So we talked about treatment options there and we decided to hang on to the tooth. Um, he decided once I adopted Lenap to go ahead and do the Lenap procedure. So we did it and uh, waited a full year before taking any x-rays and to do any probing. When I did the probing, it went from nine millimeters to two millimeters, which really blew my mind and the patient was very happy, especially to know that he wouldn't, wasn't going to lose those, the bridge and uh, he wouldn't need to, need, need to have implants in that area.